Hey guys, Gruz here. Hope you guys are doing well today. Well, in this video, we're going to check out this retro computer game called Monkey Shines. This is an action platformer where you've got to run around this giant stage collecting these red keys in order to open the exit at the end of the level. The levels are kind of maze-like, but there are sections where there is like a specific way that you have to go. I'll show you what I'm talking about. If you enjoy this video at any time, make sure to leave a like on it to let me know. I'm trying to grow this channel and it really helps out if you do that. Monkey shines. Let's go check out the controls here. So, I'm not using my mouse stick. I'm going to use the keyboard here. And the controls are very simple in this game. Check this out. We just got one thing to move left, one thing to move right, and one thing to jump. That's pretty much all there is to it. Just move left, move right, and jump. Let's just jump right into it. You might notice the awesome music in this game. This game has great music. And we'll just start at the first stage. I've never beat this first stage even, but I'm gonna give it a shot today. So these are the keys right here that we have to try and find, the red ones. The blue ones, like the one up there, is for a bonus level. The red ones are the main ones though. And you can't fall too far. You'll see that I just hurt myself. Oh wow, I fell too far there. This game's from 1995, 1996. And I believe it might have been influenced by Donkey Kong Country. I'm just going to guess and say that because it's got the 3D rendered gorilla. Or I think it's supposed to be a monkey, but monkeys have tails and this guy doesn't seem to have a tail. But yeah, look at these fun enemies in this game. Like right there we got a gravestone. And then up there we got some teeth. This game is full of a bunch of fun enemies. They got that shiny 90s 3D look to them. Everything's so shiny and smooth. So we'll go up here. And we need to get up to the top there, but there's no way we're going to get past those skulls. So see up there, there's a shield. We got to go and get that shield. So we'll get past these guys. Hopefully we can get up there. And the wings make it so you can fall without dying. Oh no! Just touching the guys once kills you. It's a tough game. It really is. Jump over him. I believe that guy's a hand. Kind of looks like a group of green bananas. So now the shield only lasts for a little bit, so we need to hurry and get up here. Such great music in this game. Now, I don't remember where to go from here. I'm thinking maybe this way. Nope, not that way. There's a bad guy right there that's about to kill me. So we'll try right. That's not the way either. So I guess down. I'm going to go right here. This is a trap right here. I can't touch that or I'll blow up. Jump over the broom. Grab the grapes. Avoid the eyeball. And avoid the bomb. I can hit that from below, I think. The spiders are not bad. They don't hurt you. So, these are the conveyor belts right here. We gotta use them to jump a little farther. But we got to make sure not to fall, because if we fall from too far, we'll die. Whoa. Just like that. 
So grab this shield, and then we can go left up here, I think, and get past this bad guy up here. I believe that's the correct way to go. And we got hot lava right there. The shield's wearing off. Get up here. Uh-oh. Oh no. Oh, just barely made that. Got the red key, got the blue key. Ooh, this is a hard part right here. We gotta fall and not hit any of these bombs. Yet, we still gotta fall inside of them. Whoa! Oh, so close. Okay, and now I think we're done with this area up here so we can go down below. Still not exactly sure where we need to go, but I think it's down here. Excuse me, mouse. And I'm guessing it's up here that we gotta go next. Oh, I'm worried something bad's gonna happen because I don't remember this. Okay, so we've got to dodge this skull. I'm just gonna wait for it to come back around again. So now's our chance. Not gonna try and go too fast here. Just take our time, one hit kills you. So, I believe we got that taken care of here. We can go back down. I'm gonna try and land on the far side of this gorilla so that he's not in our way. Now we go. Hop through this stuff. Don't wanna to touch that water. That would be bad. Grab this blue key right here. Oh, ooh, that's so close. Now we're back at the beginning. I think we gotta go up on that top floor right there next. So we'll jump up here. Just hope I don't miss a key anywhere. Don't think I did. Yum, it said. He likes the taste of keys. Alright, so I'm gonna try and jump over this skull. I'm gonna wait till it's moving away. Just like that. And then, to get back, I think I might go below. Because I don't think I can get over that skull. So we'll climb back up here, and go to the right. What is that guy? Is like a piranha plant or something? Some very imaginative enemies here. So again, I think we have to go to the right here. I believe so. Unless we already went this way. I think we already went this way. Dang it! Yeah, we did go this way. Well, actually, we didn't go all the way left, did we? Yeah, I don't think we did. So we'll, we'll go left here. That gold thing up there, that is an extra life. So we gotta grab this extra life. If we can manage to. Can never have too many of those. Oh! Especially because of that kind of stuff. 
I wasn't expecting it to be just a cliff right there. All right, grab the key if we can. I think that means we got all the keys because the timer's going off now. How in the world? There we go. Okay, let's go. I guess that guy can fly. Um, I don't know what's up there. Pretty sure I have to go down here, if I remember correctly. I'm gonna go down here. Oh no! Oh! What is that? Is that the bonus level? Uh-oh. Where did that take me? I don't think I've ever been here before. I'm not sure where we are. I do know I want to get that X4 though. Sounds good to me. I guess we'll just explore here a little bit and grab all these fruits. They're so delicious. Can never have enough fruit. Okay. Well, I'm guessing that this must have been the bonus area that we were at. And we can get out of it this way. Yep, that's it. So now we get the wings here. So that we can fall over here. Uh-oh. Oh, we made it! Yeah! <laughs> Look at those skulls shaking like that. That's awesome. Just take my time here. Oh, that was close. Jump over the hot lava here. Jump! Jump! Oh! Oh, we're so close to the end, too. I've actually never gotten this close to beating it. But I must say, I never spent a great deal of time with this game. Yeah! Yeah! Look at that! We got to the exit. Level 1 is beaten. Not Donkey Kong. Oh, we didn't even collect half of the fruit. It's not Donkey Kong. Alright, on to Spaced Out. So here's the first key. This game looks so 90s. Has such an awesome aesthetic to it. Too bad no one makes games like this anymore. Whoa, that guy's moving too fast. I think I'm gonna go down here and grab this red key. We got one life left, guys. I'm thinking I have to go down there to the left. I think that's what I'm going to try to do. Uh-oh. 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 I could try to get that blue key, but I don't have any feather left. Oh! Game over, dude. We beat up the monkey. Look at that high score. 
Well, that was a taste of monkey shines. Doesn't that smooth 3D graphic style bring you back to like 1996? I know it does for me. That's a style that I don't think ever came back. That shiny 3D, that is super cool. Hopefully one day I'll be able to beat the entire game and then I'll do a for real video about it. But I hope you enjoyed this little taste of the game today. If you did, make sure to leave a like on it to let me know. And if you haven't already, subscribe to this channel. I do all sorts of classic Mac gaming on this channel. So if you want to see more of that, make sure to subscribe. Thanks guys. I'll see you soon in the next video. Goodbye.